Oh my god, why in the world is pi choose equal? Let me talk about this right here first. When we have n choose k, this right here just equal to n factorial divided by k factorial times n minus k, and then we factorial that. And remember, when we have n factorial, we can use the integral definition, either the pi function or the gamma function. Either way, we'll get n factorial to be the integral going from 0 to infinity, and we have t to the nth power e to the negative t dt. Yes, we'll be using this and that together to do this, which is really, really cool. Check this out. When we have pi choose e, on the top, we'll get pi factorial on the bottom we will have e factorial and then pi minus e factorial oh my goodness yes on the top it's going to be integral integral what yes integral going from 0 to infinity t to the pi's power e to the negative t dt and then divided by we have another integral here the integral going from 0 to infinity t to the e's power e to the negative t dt times this is another integral going from 0 to infinity t to this power pi minus e and then we multiply by e to the negative t dt and you can just do all this and then let me tell you guys that you will get approximately 1.904 right that's it that's pi to z